I will take one example. Let's take one example. Suppose we have given a diagram that this is the set P and this is the set Q. Where the elements are this is 4, 9 and 25. And it is minus 2. Minus 5, minus 3, minus 2, then plus 2, plus 3, plus 5, and 3. This is the set B, this is the set Q, where 4 is mapping with 2 and minus 2. This 9 is mapping with minus 3 and 3. 25 is with minus 5. So, it is a diagram of relation where R is defined from a set P to Q. Now, how we can type it? This R is a relation from P to Q where domain is, what is the domain of this set? Domain is P, domain is here P, what it is? 4, 9, 25. And range, what is the range? Range is called the set of those elements which are matching with the domain set. So it is minus 5, minus 3, 2, 3, 5 and minus. So this is the main set and co-domain set. Co-domain is the total set that is Q. So we can see that range is always a subset of codomain. Range set is always a subset of codomain. The codomain is a total set Q. Now we, may, we are writing this relation R in a roster form as well as set order form. So if we write it in a roster form, how we can write it? This 4 is mapping with minus 2. And 4 is mapping with plus 2. Then 9 is mapping with minus 3. 9 is mapping with plus 3. Then 5. So 25 is mapping with minus 5. And 25 is mapping with 5. So this is the relation in roster form. Now we can write it in a set builder form. How? This x form of y such that x is a square of y. Okay? And one more thing. x belongs to p, set p. This x is always from set p. And this y belongs to set q. So this is the representation of relation in set builder form. And this is the representation of relation in roster form. Okay? It is clear. Now, if we talk about what are the maximum number of what are the maximum number of relations that we can define that we can define from set P to set Q. If this is the question then how many relations we can define from a set P to a set Q? So this formula is, if we have given number of elements in set P is, uh, let it be A, okay, A. And number of elements in set Q is B. Then how many, how many elements are in partition product P and Q? This is, this already I have uh, explained to you, it is always a into B. Okay. So number of uh, one thing the relation. What is the definition of relation? A relation is a is always is always a subset of partition product of P and Q. Relation is always a subset of partition product P and Q. So maximum number of relation is number of subsets we can define of P and Q. So, so number of subsets is 
number of subsets of p cross q. This is two to the power number of elements in p cross q. It is always fixed. Number of subset means two to the power that number. So it is. Power number of elements in P cross Q is a b a to b. So this is the maximum number of relation also. So now maximum maximum number of relations defined from P to Q that is also same as two to the power a into Thank you. 